I got my first ever AI automation agency client. In this video, I'm gonna be doing a full breakdown of the service delivery. You're gonna be able to come along with me as I build out this chatbot for a client of mine. You get to see all the things that go through my head as I build this out. So if you guys wanna see how to deliver for your AI automation agency clients, this video is going to be for you. One thing I wanna mention before we dive right into this bot build for my client is that I want to say, this is not gonna be an overly complex bot build in BotPress or VoiceFlow, or it's not gonna take me two hours to build this out for you guys. This is a practical way for you guys to actually go and bring chatbots and service delivery to your clients and not have to research and figure out exactly how to do all these things and make it overly complicated. So if you wanna see how you could do this real fast for your clients, this video is gonna be for you. I'm gonna go over a simple technique and simple strategy in order to still bring value to your clients without having to overly complicate it for no reason. I do this for every video, but if you don't know me or this YouTube channel, my name is Brock Messerich. I am the founder of AI Accelerator. It's an AI automation agency, and I wanted to make this channel to document the beginning process of actually what it looks like when you start your AI automation agency. So I don't show you me on the beach with girls or fancy watches and nice cars. Instead, I'm documenting this process so you could see what it looks like in the dirt of actually starting to make money with your AI automation agency. If you want to follow along with somebody in the same shoes as you, this YouTube channel is for that. So to get right into it, if you guys haven't seen my last video, I actually secured my first ever AI automation agency client. And so in this video, we're going to be building out this chap up for him. You're going to see the full behind the scenes of the service delivery. So now we need to dive into exactly what it is we're looking to create for this client of mine. So my client owns a Kratom e-commerce business. So he sells Kratom extract products, which is kind of like spinoff of CBD. It's one of those like herbal supplement sort of things. And he's looking for ways to integrate AI into his business. And so I basically told him, I was like, Hey, we could create a customer service chatbot that is trained on your website and documents that we feed it in order to automate customer service for you and to answer any Kratom related products for your customers that are on your website as well as even push them directly to the products to purchase these products within this chatbot. For this initial chatbot that we're going to integrate onto his website it doesn't need to be anything too complex and so he voiced that to me he said hey let's just throw up this customer service chatbot on the website to help with any questions we get and to push them to our products and then from there we could work on some back-end automation so he gave me some ideas for essentially pulling their email address and adding it directly to their email marketing software or to be able to track the tracking order of their orders through their back-end tracking system. So he has different ideas of what we could do with this customer service chatbot, but to start off and what we're going to be building in this video is just the basic customer service chatbot. And so for the sake of that, we're actually not gonna be using BotPress or VoiceFlow. We're gonna be using something different and I'm gonna show you how you could actually make this for your clients in five, 10, 15 minutes. And it's not something that's too complex, but still provides real value to your clients. So without wasting any more of your time, let's dive right into the build of this chatbot. All right, so let's dive right into the software we're actually gonna be using to build out this AI chatbot for our clients. So we're gonna come over to this right here. So you could see, this is something that's really interesting I wanna point out to you. So this right here, AI Accelerator, this is my brand. This is my AI automation agency. AI Accelerator, and you could see it is branded, this dashboard is branded to my agency. And you could see also this domain here, I have a custom domain set for my agency. So this looks as if it is my own software. And so you might be asking Brock, how did you create your own chatbot software? And to answer that, I am using a chatbot software called Stammer. AI. So let's take a look at this. So you are able to actually use this chatbot software and white label it to your own agency. So if I were to log in here, let me log in to my Stammer account. So now I am in my Stammer account. You could see it says Stammer.ai and the URL also says Stammer.ai. So Stammer is the software gonna be we're gonna be using, but we're able to brand on top of the software. So we could actually sell this as our own. And that's something we're gonna be doing in this demo here. So you could see I'm now in my app.aiaccelerator.digital which is my custom domain. And so we could come over to my chatbots. And what we could do is we could come over, create new chatbot, and then we can name it kind of whatever we wanna name it. So for this one, let's just say first client for the video. Let's copy paste that. And then for the initial message, let's just say, what Kratom related questions do you have for me? So what we're gonna do now is we're actually gonna create a base system prompt with ChatGPT4. So this is going to actually generate 
this right here that we're gonna feed this automatically. So we could use AI to actually do this. So if you don't know the base system prompt, let's read here the information behind it. So basically what it says is this input trains your AI bot instructing on how to interact based on the knowledge base. Think of your bot as an initially uninformed entity learning through this learning process. So that is exactly what we're gonna do here. And we're gonna use ChatGPT to do it for us. So that's how we could do this super simply is just with ChatGPT. So if you check out this resource, so this resource is actually in my free resources down in the description in the comments, make sure to fill that out and you will be emailed a Google file with all of my resources. And so this is going to be an amazing resource for you to actually do this and create this base system prompt in minutes with ChatGPT. So you can see we already have a prompt here. So I need you to help me write the best possible prompt for my needs so I can use it for a large language model AI to take on the persona of a customer service chatbot or assistant for a business. So essentially, this will just make all this for you. All we have to do is copy and paste this link down here with the website we're going to train all this information on. So now I'm gonna copy paste all this. So there we go, that's all copied. And so what I'll do is I'll come into ChatGPT4, I'll paste that in. And then what I wanna do is I want to change this with the website URL of, you know, for my client. So I already did this and I don't need to generate this now. So this is what it spit out for me. So this is my base system prompt here. So you are an extract bot, the friendly virtual assistant for company name. You know, I don't want you guys to know the company name for obvious reasons. And so this prompt is now perfectly crafted for us to be able to come into our base system prompt and basically copy paste this. So now that that is there, I'm gonna change this to ChatGPT4 just cause it's better and you know, it's, it's gonna give better responses. And so yeah, now let's kind of create the chatbot. And now is where I want to actually add the website URL for this so that way it can be trained on this website URL. So let me do that. Again, I wanna keep this information confidential, but I'm going to do that and then I'll come back once that is done. All right, so we actually have this chatbot now trained on the website. So let's go ahead and test this out. It's not gonna be perfect. We're gonna have to make some retuning to this, but let's just test it out to see the functionality. So we're prompted with this. So what Kratom related questions do you have for me? I wanna ask, what is a good product for a beginner? So let's see what that spits out. So for beginners, Red Vein Kratom is a good starting point as it has some more relaxing effects. So cool, that's informative. I'd love for it to actually point us directly to the URL link so they could directly add this to the cart on their website. So let's ask a few more questions. So why do you recommend? Red Vein is recommended because it offers relaxing components, aids with aches and discomforts, and helps elevate mood levels. So that's a good answer. Let's ask maybe a few more questions. What is a good product? to help with my low energy. Our caffeinated liquid kratom extract and kratom infused honey sticks are popular choices for natural energy boost. So again, that's an awesome response. However, I wanted to point us directly to the URL. So now let's go into edit this chatbot actually and to add this kind of prompt to it so that way it points them directly to links. So I went ahead and just wrote something uh, myself in this base system prompt. So let's read this off what I added. So you're going to be on our website to answer any questions relating to our products, as well as always point them to the exact link of the product you suggest. Your main job is to, be, to give suggestions to the users and send them direct links to the products you suggest. If a product is out of stock, let your user know it is out of stock. I want you to respond with less than five sentences every time. Please try to keep the responses short and to the point, but still be very helpful. Add some personality to the responses and even some humor maybe if you provide an email to the user add the link please so um cool that should help and let's go ahead and update the chatbot and then we'll test it out again so now that i updated that let's go ahead and test this out again see kind of what the response is going to be from this chatbot so what kratom related questions do you have for me again it prompts us with that upon speaking with the chatbot and so let's just say i want a product for a good night sleep and so i spelled product wrong but it should catch that and even though it's a typo so that's a good thing and that's the great thing with chatbot so for a good night's sleep i recommend the layla cali shot comes in a sleep formula that contains melatonin and long word i don't know how to pronounce it which are known to promote relaxation and sleep here's a link to the product sweet dream so boom so there we go directs us directly to the product that's what i was wanting um and so let's ask a few more questions i want to get my one lol and let's see what that spits out. You could see that uh, 
Also, it says train better response. So you could train the response you'd rather have it give you. And so that'll obviously help us with a better response in the future. So how about surprising her with her own Kratom infused honey sticks? They're sweet, simple instruction to Kratom. They can be added to tea, smoothies, and just enjoy it on their own. Here's the link. Enjoy your gift giving. So again, this is awesome. This is exactly how I want this thing to respond. It's very personable, adds a bit of humor, has some personality to it, and then it sends us directly to the links to actually buy these products. So this is exactly what we're looking for. So yeah, we'll keep fine retuning this. So I wanna show you guys now kind of the back end of kind of this software of what I'm using. And this is actually a dashboard I'm gonna to give to my client and it's gonna be white labeled to my agency, obviously. So first of all, what we wanna do is let me go ahead and start a new chat with this chatbot now. So you could see here, this is kind of just like a user interface that we're prompted with. And you could see it immediately says, please provide your email. So right here, I'm gonna provide my email and this is a lead capture form. So whenever they interact with this, they're going to, we're actually gonna take their email here. But something I wanna to note to you guys is something that Stammer is actually working on right now and it should be out in like a week or two, I was told, is they're gonna have custom fields when you're interacting with this chatbot. So instead of being prompted with this where you have to ask the user for their email literally you could have it so if you're in a conversation with them and you have the chatbot naturally ask what their email is it'll automatically pull that information and add it to our back end and save it and query that information and so we don't even have to ask them right here like use this form where it asks what their email is we could just have it naturally ask hey do you mind if i have your email address and it'll automatically be added and then there's going to be some other automations in there where it's automatically kind of added to kind of different automations that you create within your crm and whatnot but let me test this to show you it so now we want to ask a few questions so let's say i want a product that will help me sleep better let's see what this spits out so for better sleep, I would recommend trying our Revive Blend. It offers a smooth energy and relaxation, making it suitable for both day and nighttime use. You can purchase Revive in powder form and capsule it yourself using our capsule maker. Here's a link to the Revive Blend. So it sends us the link to this product, tells us what it does, how it's gonna help us sleep. So that's cool. Obviously that's the chatbot. But what we really wanna focus on is the back end here. So you gotta think, this is what the client is going to be able to log into. So they're gonna be able to see all of this. So we're gonna come up here to this blue bottle, bubble and click view conversations. And and you can see this is a conversation we just had at the chatbot. So if you scroll down here, you could see every single conversation that happens on the front end of the user interface of the chatbot, but you see it in our back end system. So you could see that it captured this email here, brockmesserich at gmail.com. It shows the chatbot user, the user ID of the chatbot. But another cool feature we want to focus on is if you come up here and click view leads, you could see every single lead that this chatbot captures within your dashboard here it gets pretty insane and you could actually export this to csv uh, csv file and add it to your crm but like i was saying where they're adding on some features where you don't even have to prompt them with the lead capture form at the beginning of interacting with the chatbot eventually within the next few weeks it's going to be able to identify that whenever you're speaking with them and the same thing with your name you know if it asks what their name is it's going to be able to identify what their name is when they respond and add that to this form here that we're looking at and it'll be able to easily integrate within their crm so then you could set up follow-up messages with ai and all that sort all that sort of stuff but this is an awesome thing that we could present to our client and this is what i'm going to present to him and i'm going to talk about this more in the next few clips but I'm gonna offer this as an upsell to the just basic chatbot that we have. So I'm gonna say, hey, if you wanna be able to capture lead information and see all the conversations on the back end, I'm gonna ask for you know a higher, you know, maybe monthly fee for it or something like that. I'm trying to figure out what the structure is gonna be. But this shows some of the capability of what we could do within Stammer. All of this again is white labeled to our brand, our agency. So it looks like it's my actual software. It's pretty honestly mind blowing. So yeah, I wanted to show this to you guys. If you guys want to sign up for Stammer, I have a affiliate link below. And yeah, it's an awesome platform and it's something I'm kind of excited to present to my clients. And hopefully, you know, it's kind of increases the perceived value of what we offer. So it is the next day. And so something I want to mention is I'm really, really excited about the fact that I could offer this in my subscription package of, you know, for my AI automation agency clients. So obviously having a chatbot is amazing. If we could automate customer service for our client, that's awesome. If we could help him sell more products with the chatbot, that's awesome. But the thing that is really game changing and where this AI automation agency is going is you need to offer something more than just that. And something that everybody values is leads. If you could capture more leads 
for these businesses as I could do with this client and even offer a custom dashboard solution where they could see every single lead that comes in as well as, like I was saying, these new features that Stammer is gonna be adding where we could actually pull these leads off of Stammer and add them to our email marketing software, all these different things. That is where things get really exciting and that's something I spoke about with my client. Like I said, he was looking at you know potentially doing that down the line, but he wanted to just do the initial chatbot first. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to offer this as an upsell. So I actually texted my client yesterday and I said, hey, listen, I have two other things I wanna mention to you that we could build out for you. And the two things are gonna be the custom dashboard so they could see all these leads that come in, as well as it's going to be having the ability to take those leads and export them to their CRM. That's something that I know is gonna provide value to him. And that's something that we could tie into in our own kind of proprietary product. You know, we have our own software that we could sell. And so this gets really interesting because not just for this client, but going forward, I could now go ahead and sell this software as a service. I could sell this as my own SaaS essentially, instead of just saying, hey, I'll come in and do, you know, make you a chatbot and build these automations for you. I could do this through a system, through a platform like Stammer that's branded to my own agency. I hope you guys could kind of wrap your brain around that. It's really mind blowing. And as this product gets built out more and more, it's a solution we're gonna be able to sell to our clients and offer as an upsell or just our native, it could be our native offer, you know, our core offer of what we're offering. And so again, I know I already mentioned this, but if you guys want to sign up with Stammer and use this system that I'm actually gonna be using for all of my clients, go ahead, I have my affiliate link below. If you guys could use the affiliate link, it really means the world if you guys decide to use this because I don't monetize my YouTube channel and it costs me a lot of money to pay for my editor to be able to edit these videos. It takes a lot of my time. So if you guys could do that, it just really supports the channel. But I would never promote a product that I don't truly believe in. And I really think the things they have on their roadmap are really just gonna be game changing. And I know Ross, the founder of Stammer, I've chatted with him lots and lots of times and he's just really looking for these solutions to give to AI automation agency owners. because. This business model is still so early on and having a product that is built for an AI automation agency owner to solve their problems is something exactly that we're looking for. So go ahead, if you want to check out Stammer, use my affiliate link below, um, it really means the world. But guys, this is something that, like I said, I'm gonna offer this as an upsell to my client. So if you guys wanna follow along and see kind of what happens with that, then make sure to subscribe to the channel. It'll be in one of my next few videos letting you know what happened with that. But yeah, so there's a little bit more fine retuning that needs to go on with this chatbot. Um, I'm gonna do it behind the scenes. If you guys wanna see the very finished product, I'll add it to my resources below. So make sure you're signed up there. And you know, maybe a few days after this video, I'll have the finished product up there that you guys can maybe test out if you'd like. So um, guys, thank you so, so much for following this YouTube channel. If you're not subscribed already, subscribe, join my Discord. We have 1500 people in there that are networking, growing their AI automation agency. And if you are a business owner and you want to integrate AI chatbots or AI lead nurturing systems within your business, or you just wanna chat AI, feel free to book a consulting call with me below. It's just a free discovery call. You can go over different ways we could integrate AI in your business. So guys, thank you so much for following along. I really, really appreciate it. And I hope you guys enjoyed me building out this solution for my client. And this is my first ever paying client. So um, thank you guys for following on my journey. See you guys in the next video.